some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Now I've got a really interesting video for you today where we have a uh, frauditor that is pretty much too young for his own good. In fact, he's way too young to be doing this because, you know, he's been influenced by the uh, frauditors who have already destroyed their own lives. So he figures he would emulate them to uh, do the same thing to his own life. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this show on the road, shall we? Can I ask you if you're filming the bank? Yeah, I am. Because I have the right to. I'm here. I'm here stress testing the right to record in public. I'm on a public way. How old are you, kid? I mean, are you old enough to understand the nuances of what you're trying to do and the possibilities of, well, you getting uh, arrested and everything like that? Are you responsible enough to understand any of that? Probably not. I mean, your voice hasn't even cracked yet. Right. I'm I'm on a public way. So you're going to call the police because I'm out here in a public way with a cell phone. So they will be calling the police, I guess. I've been dangerous with a phone, right? You know, kid, uh, you got to uh, understand this uh, right here. You're following down the footsteps of those who uh, already have a criminal record and have no future ahead of them. They screwed up their lives starting right about your age. You still have a future. Don't let this affect the rest of your life. You still have uh, the ability to uh, make the right choices and make the right choices. Go to college. Go to a trade school. Whatever you want to do with your life. Something that will affect you your life positively, not this garbage. She informed me that the police will be coming. That would be a nice, nice thing to see. Police show up here. Hopefully give them some a free education on how I have the right to do this. Might even give them some education right over the phone. Oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> Not sure yet. That lady just flipped me off. Not sure the year of it. We will be staying until the police arrive. If they are arriving. Here come the police, lights on. Two of them. going on? I ask you the same question. What's going on today? I'm recording. Can I get a name and badge number, please? I'm asking you a question first. What are you doing over here? I'm on a public way recording. Okay. Where are you recording? The bank. The bank? Why are you recording the bank? Just recording. No reason, huh? Yeah, this kid's been influenced by frauditors, all right, especially Kansas City Accountability. Yeah, he's been doing this a lot lately with banks and uh, ended up getting arrested the other day for doing the exact same thing. So, dude, that's the path you're heading down. You don't want this on your record. Nope. Does it sound, any, sound suspicious or anything? Shouldn't be. It's constitutionally protected. All right, but you're in the roadway. You know, I am. I'm on the side of the road. You're, you're still in the road. You can feel a hazard to traffic. You can feel uh, I'm, right, I'm right here. Listen. I'm not in the road. Still, you in, are still in the a road. hazard to traffic. How old are you? 
15. All right, do you have your parents anywhere? Uh, you don't need to talk to my parents. I uh, yeah, they do. Uh, you're still a juvenile according to the law, so therefore the officers have to contact your parents so that way they can make sure you are safe if they even care about you whatsoever. And if they do, they would make sure that you are not doing this kind of BS to begin with. Now, because you're a juvenile. How? Because I can't let you go on your own now. Now that we've been called, we have to talk to your parents. So doesn't matter. I am I can still walk around and I still own my rights to the Constitution. Can I get a name and badge number, please? Listen. Can I get a name and badge number, Listen, please? I will. But we need to call your parents because I can't release you, like, on your own. You have to be released to a parent or guardian. So you can't walk around? No, so we got called here because you were filming the bank. That the don't... That's... I'm, I'm, I'm on the side of the road. Well, you're in, you're in, you're, the, road. You're in, in the, the road. You're in the road when I approach, and you're in the road now. You're in the road. So right. you could be up here, but now that since you're a juvenile and you're 15, we can't... Yeah, I still own my rights to record in public. You You're only 15 years old. You don't know how the world works completely yet. And this is just further proof of that right here by the fact that you are pretty much a safety hazard right here on the side of the road. Not to mention that you think you're educating the cops at this point, when in reality they are telling you you do have the right to record, but they are also informing you that you are 15 years old and therefore a juvenile, and as such, they are legally obligated to contact your parents to make sure that you are indeed safe. And at your age, it is difficult for you to understand that concept, but it's reality. Record. We and that's what I'm record. doing, so why do you need to call my parents? Because we cannot release you by yourself. You are 15 years old. We need to release you to a parent. That doesn't matter if I'm 15 years old. It does. Okay. Can I get a name and badge number, please? Brady, 731. Thank you. Wacky 730. So can Thank you, you please call your parents? Oh, I cannot. So here's the deal. If you don't call your parents, then we're gonna like we, we can't release you. We're going to stay here. You need to call your parents. Call my parents for recording in a public place. No, we're gonna have to call you. We can't the roadway. The roadway uh, is I'm, not a I'm public not place. On the, roadway. the roadway is a public place. It is a public place, but it's a safety hazard. We not we didn't say you was can't record. Was I standing in the middle of the road? I was a dog. You're standing on the side of the road. We had people call us it's telling us you're a safety You had the bank teller call because I was recording the bank. I'm at a public place the recording roadway. the bank. And you're in the roadway. Okay. But now that you're 15, we need your parents involved. So can you please call your parents? No, I'm 18. Okay, now you are just heading down a bad road uh, even further at this point, considering you are lying about your age, and that could get you into some serious trouble with the cops. So you may want to think about that, because you could certainly be charged as an adult at this point. Can I get a incident number, please? Two? Absolutely. One. Once we have one. You, but we're going to call your Listen parents. Listen to this officer and call your parents. You don't need to call my parents. Yes, we do. I cannot let you go. Show me where that is. Like, where where where'd you get you, that we're, at? We're, we're I'm telling you what it is. Or we can arrest you. Uh, arrest me for recording in a public place. No, because you won't call your parents. It will take you into protective custody. I don't need custody. to call my parents. You do. All right. Suspicion's a crime. Suspicion is not I'm a crime. I'm asking you to identify yourself. You, you have to identify no, yourself. No, I do not. Yes, not at all. Do. No, I do not. Where do you go to school? Shepherd Hill? Or I'd, I'd like to exercise my Fifth Amendment right, please. Can I get the incident number now, please? We will get I'm working that to on you. getting it. I already called for it. Perfect, thank you. I'll get it for you right now. Give me a minute. Please get on. I'm off the side of the road. You're too close to the road. I don't want you to get it. Well, this belongs to the bank, doesn't it? Yeah, which means it's private property. Exactly, that's why I wasn't on it. Stampy. You see this, uh, kid? Uh, you are pretty much standing on the road right here. This grassy area, most likely it belongs to the bank and therefore is private property. So you're either standing on private property, which means they can trespass you, or you're standing on the public roadways, which makes you a hazard to the drivers that are trying to avoid hitting a child at this point so so this frame right here is kind of working against you at this point because you're a danger to everybody right now filming from the roadway can't be filming from private property either correct so 
you need to go somewhere Two, safe. Four, you want to continue three, to film. Zero, nine, eight, nine. Perfect. Thank you. You want to continue to film. You need to find a safe location. So we don't care. That it's you're not the roadway. We do not care. You're just in the roadway. And road. if you get hit by a car, I don't want to see that happen. And right. then, because you're 15, we have to release your parents. We can't just let you go. Because we don't know if you're lost or anything like that, or, ran, or a runaway. I'll tell you I'm not lost, and I ain't run away. We don't know that, because well, we don't identify know. It's because I don't need to identify myself. But according to you, I do. Yeah. Do you go to Dudley Shepherd Hill or the middle school? I'd like to exercise my Fifth Amendment right then. Yeah. I'll just exercise. Just stress testing the right to record in public. This is a public place. Didn't know I wasn't allowed on the public road. Record, record we never said public. you couldn't record. Well, I was recording in public, and you have a problem with it. You're making my mom come oh, There was no point in your interaction with these officers that they said that you are not allowed to record here. Now, there are several pro other problems that need to be addressed in this particular situation, young man. First one being is you are under the age of 15 and therefore still subject to a lot of uh, restrictions by the law. Your parents will have to be contacted for your own safety. And speaking of safety, the other piece of this puzzle is the fact that you are standing on the road or partially on the road at this point, which creates a safety hazard. And then there's the final piece of this puzzle, where you are filming uh, the bank on their own property, and therefore you can be trespassed. Even as an adult, you can be trespassed, or as a child, you can be too. So there are just so many things wrong with you at this point that, uh, well, you need to be dealt with. That way, you're not a hazard to anybody at this point, especially to yourself. Putting from a roadway, and you are a hazard to traffic. That's the why we're here. Is a suspicious person. Suspicion is not a crime. Recording the bank from the roadway. We get here, you're in the roadway recording the bank. I'm off the side of the road. We never said you couldn't record. And then I ask you how old you are, you tell me 15. You're now juvenile. Once you're a juvenile, we have to release you to your parents because okay. we came down here to investigate. My parents can come down here. Once your parents get here, it's up to them what they want you to do. And if you didn't want to call your parents, we would just take you into custody until we explaining how this works. Would you be able to go in there and give them a free education on how I can record the bank in a public place? Just so they know for next time if someone comes here? You can go in there and talk to them all you want. But when they call us because you're creating a disturbance, that's a problem. Right, but you, you can't go in there and inform them on what they called on? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my goodness, kid, you don't even uh, fully understand the script either. This is not the point where you uh, tell them to go in there and educate the uh, personnel in the building about the uh, First Amendment. This is the point of the script where a lot of frauditors will go to, uh, I'll leave under threat of arrest or something like that. That's where they would be at at this point, not go in there and educate them. No, they would have long since realized they're not going to do that. So you really don't even understand the script yet. Oh my goodness, kid. Uh, yeah, you need help. We came down here to talk to you. And then if you want us to go tell them that he didn't work toward, yes. But the, I think the main problem was you were in the middle of the roadway. I would like you to go give them a free education, please. Okay, well, that, we, that's not our right. We're not going to do that. You're not going to go tell them? All no, right. I'm not going to tell them. Again, the original call Can came in. Please get on the grass so you do not get hit by a car. Private because car. It, it doesn't matter. If you get hit by a car, it's on us. So we're going to sit right here away from the roadway. There's cars coming down. I do not want you to get in trouble or get hit. Also, recording banks is suspicious because we don't know if you're casing the bank for a robbery. That does happen. Yeah, it does happen, but I am nothing constitutionally protected. There's nothing that says you can't, but it is suspicious. And the police were called and the 
police should go give tell them that I can record a bank from a well, public way. Nobody has to told you you can't record. And we didn't tell you you can't record. I know. Show one instance where we told you you could not record. You didn't. Okay. Kid, my suggestion to you is to just give up now. The script, well, you the script didn't fail. You failed. You failed to understand the script to begin with because, you know, you don't have any experience with it like the uh, primary frauditors do, and even they fail with it from time to time. And besides, you're too damn young for this uh, kind of BS anyway. Go back to school, have fun, date girls, uh, do all those other things that uh, kids do before they uh, turn 18 and have to get a job and everything like that, before the real world slaps them in the face. What did we tell you when we got here? Why we were here? I'd like to exercise my fifth amendment, please. Okay. Get this picture and send it to Tyler. Well, I'm going to find out who he is. Yeah, well. So Tyler Smith knows exactly what I'm doing. And that's fine. We good. I'm all for, you know, exercising your rights. But we gotta do it safely. We can't do it in what after. Were you, what were you saying? Like, like Nothing. Just, just recording. Yeah, that's And then fine. she came out here and had a problem with me. Yeah, and that's, I mean, that's... It's just, you real. you can record things. I'm not having a problem with that. But it is suspicious to the police because there are no... When somebody's recording a bank, we don't know who you are. We don't know if you're planning to, you know, rob a bank. If somebody sent you here to record the bank to rob the bank. I'm just saying, that's that's the stuff that... We don't know. We don't you know. You can tell us whatever, we still don't know. And because there are instances well, of people you're detained. Because we're Why? waiting for I'm your detained mom. now. I'm detained now. Now this is where the video ends, folks. Now I understand that this kid was returned to the custody of his mother. Now let's just hope that she doesn't encourage this kind of thing and... Uh, well, encourages her son to do more productive things with his time because this kid has three years left before he uh, enters the working force, uh, if he does at all, if he stays on the right track instead of uh, going out uh, frauding and potentially committing crimes, getting himself arrested and everything else like that, which will make his life harder in the long run if he does any of that stuff now let's just hope that this kid turns out to be another big Wes who realized the error of his ways before it's too late and uh did something with his life so at any rate guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one this could be some groundbreaking stuff right here Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?